right, now we're on Taurus All Signed Singles. Okay. All right, so let's see here. Knight of Pentacles. Okay, so uh, whoever it is from your past or future um, is suggesting give a small offer. And I feel like you might be meeting them at night. Okay, now it could be outdoors because I'm getting fern. Okay, and here's the star. So I feel like you're going to meet this person at night. I keep getting that. Okay. Air sign is strong. Excuse me. Air sign is really strong here. Okay, so you got earth. Now, for some of you, this could have represented you were busy trying to bring some work stuff in, so you weren't really focused on, um, and you were focused on your healing, so you weren't interested in really connecting with anybody. You had to clear your mind space of whatever... that the points that were painful in the past... Now, this is like feeling a little bit like the Aries energy here. All right, now, the wish fulfillment is possible. That's what they're saying. But again, it's about feeling good again, feeling whole, being clear in your mind, and being clear about what you're offering and what you're capable of offering. It's like being able to know your intentions in this love thing all right now you could be in the limelight or social media or something right okay now that's coming up since this could also represent text so it could be that could be you or it could be someone you're connecting with okay through the internet okay all right, Ace of Wands. So there is this like passion here. Now, I there is a story about this tiger and freeing the tiger. Is it Queen Latifah? Okay, so you might be feeling um, in a teaching mode or um, anyway, in that story, I think she was like a um, kind of like a guide. So maybe it's like talking about connecting with your inner passion, your inner fire, right? To move um, to see your wish, your wishes being fulfilled. Okay, now here is Six of Wands. That's recognition in the public eye being seen. So now for some of you, you could have been working towards, um, you could have already been in the public eye and building on what you were doing, or this is someone who is building uh, whatever their their creative stuff, their creative force is bringing them in the light. Okay, now this could be like receiving awards, being recognized. Okay, now I'm getting coordinates. Okay, so I'm getting like tattoos and coordinates. Okay, so... You might be into acting for someone. You might go into acting. Okay. Yeah, and it's like whatever it is that you've been dreaming about, it's like you step into a new world when you go towards what you really want. Now, this could also represent there was something in the past that you were working on that felt maybe mundane to you. But now that you're actually putting 
energy into what you really want to do, there is this transformation happening here. Okay, this is like taking the steps towards it. Two of Wands here, right? Okay. All right, now, there is no indecision. This is Two of Swords reverse. You are clear. This is moving in clarity. Now, that came up in the uh, Aries. Okay, so in the Aries reading, it was all about releasing the past hurts to wake up to uh, the person that was uh, there for them. Yeah, see? And then, bam, here's the love that walks in the door. Okay, so here's the love. Now, Taurus is a throat chakra. Okay, so there may have been times where you felt like you were feeling so much passion and then it just stopped at the throat level. This is suggesting just, and then here's the theme of the kind of the coronation, right? I, I saw today popping up here. Okay, so here's like ships and crowns. So your ships are coming in. This is like... Uh, being in uh, authority, some sort of uh, authority, which that could have represent that Queen Latifah. Okay. And Okay, so now this could represent a Scorpio. It could represent that Scorpionic energy. This could represent the transformation. There's a huge butterfly here, right? Okay, now I feel like this is like spirit bringing in your world and um, they want you to be the receiver of what you created. Okay, and it could just be about moving emotions, even. But here's the Six of Cups with the Judgment. This looks like, to me, um, that you're going to go back to a past person. Let's see. Let's get another card. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like this story is you're going to go back to a past person. Okay, you know, it's like when people, okay, they date around, they go and do their thing, and there might even be, you know, two seasons that go by, or four seasons that go by a couple of times, and then all of a sudden, there's like this resurgence of feeling of, wanting to go back to the past person okay so that's what I'm getting <laughs> and here's a two wands so it's like just follow your intuition your impulse right to move with that love and here's dogwood and I also saw the fleur-de-lis on the crown today okay so I feel like you're in your power and it's just about moving your world and moving taking those steps okay yeah for some of you it is a water sign could be cancer Scorpio Pisces okay now okay so let's see because what is the hidden element here okay what is the hidden element Oh, I see. The fear is that someone's not going to stay with you and that they're going to walk away. Or you you might have a fear that you won't be able to stick with it. Okay, now that's subconscious was subconscious for someone. Okay, but this is suggesting just move with your passion. Go for it. Move. Two of wands, king of wands. Move with your passion. Um, ooh. Ten of Pentacles. Wow. Okay. So just keep moving where your passion leads you. And here is the 
Nine of Cups, which is wish fulfillment. And see, this one's facing in the past, so I think it's a past person. But at any rate, um, I feel like there's going to be a resurgence here. And Ten of Pentacles is actually building something in the physical reality. Okay. All right. Now, there could have been some sort of, like, I'm getting uh, tight um, finances. Okay. Now, someone could have broke up with someone because you didn't like the way they managed money. You could have even had arguments about it. But there is this workability. You can talk those things out. And if finance is very important to you. It's like put those things up front on the table. Okay. And see, and all that will be worth it. Because this is a relationship that's going to uh, blossom. And what's interesting is Aries got this card too. So... So I feel like the message there then is that if you felt like you were left out of that, um, the love thing, um, it is tangible in the physical. Yeah, there is someone who wants to work on it with you. Okay, could be a fire sign or air sign for somebody. But I feel like what that represents is the balance that, yeah, the balance that you create. It could be through a work connection that was coming up in the Aries. Okay. This is coming up too. You might be connecting with the Aries for some of you. Yeah. Yeah, it's someone that you feel nostalgic about. Yeah, and I picked up cold climate for someone because when I was flipping this out, I was like, is it this way or this way? And I got the feeling of cold weather when I was doing this because in the Aries reading, it was like uh, Miami. But I'm, I've, for someone, it's someone who lives in a cold, who has the seasons. Okay. Someone that is your... Um, oh, wait a minute. That's five of pentacles, not six of pentacles. That was, um, uh, there was some argument about the money for some of you. Now, sometimes that represents the arguments about uh, material stuff in the family dynamic or work dynamic that affected the um, desire to not go towards any love connection. Oh, yeah, because here's the five of swords. So that was an argument. Okay. Yeah, and it, here is the transformation. Yeah, and it was like a lot of mind stuff. But here's the stability. Yeah, it's like freeing your mind to see the ships coming in. Yeah. And I feel like the success is, is that when you have that kind of fast, fiery communication, is to take a breath and illuminate your mind before you take the um, before you communicate and that could just be talking about mercury retrograde so in two weeks that's going to clear up if there was something that came out funky it's, it's repairable that's what they're saying the world as the world turns It just requires you to stay focused, yeah, in those places that are where the improvement is. Okay, I'll leave you with that.